Hi, my name is Jeff Phillips, and I am a 10th grader currently attending uh, Castum High School, and we're located at the shop here on the campus. Right now, the students are in Manufacturing Tech 1, and they are using a competition put on by CODA uh, to have best in STEM, and what that is, is there's one of four sections they get to pick from to, to redesign or design a better, better version of the nose cone, chassis, suspension, and gearbox. My team is focusing on the nose cone, and that's basically the front of the car, and we're trying to make it more aerodynamic so that the car is able to run faster. Everyone does play a role in this project, whether if it's something like designing to actually being hands-on with it, which is very good because some people, they don't like to design, but they like to build what people design. So we just need to learn our strengths and weaknesses and then learn how to collaborate through those. This contest is providing is an understanding of the different four aspects of the, the car, which will translate to our year-long project which is designing, competing, and understanding the Electrothon car for four different teams. I think we can succeed because different people's ideas, because there's different people in the classroom. So we've got people who think of more technical side or somebody who thinks of more logical side and we could bring those ideas together and they all contribute and help each other. The way that this is a lot different from just sitting down at a regular old desk is that this is like a hands-on project. Like We actually have control of the car and what's going to go down on the project. Like The, the uh, professors are just guiding us in the right way, but we basically have control of what we want to do. Our teacher challenges us by giving us problems and we have to be able to solve those and we think, oh, this is what we have to do. And after a while, he comes and assists us being like, oh, how about you do that? And once we all think about it, we're able to come together as a class and be like, this is something we can do together to make it easier for everybody else. Something I'd like to share is that this is not only just we're building it just to build it, because I believe that it's also a good learning experience for like everyone, me including the other, my other classmates. It's a good learning experience because you learn how to work with a group of like unique students and unique people like from like all different backgrounds. We can learn how to work as a team together and we can, anything that we learn from this project, we can implement it later on when we go hands on the electric car or simply just designing a part for it. The reason why I'm interested in this field is because I've always had an interest around engineering and like learning how to build things and learning how to design things. I want to do something that's around mechanics so like working with cars or working with electrical cars specifically is what I really want to do. And that perfectly ties into what we're doing in engineering right now. This school has really allowed me to have these resources available to me. Um, for instance, we might be working with the software later on in life, so it's better to have us like, give us like a head start now so that we can have the ability to develop uh, our skills with the, with the technology that we're using and so that when we get into the workforce, we're not just sitting there looking at the computer. Do you know how some students are like, oh, why am I in this class why, if I'm not going to use it in real life? Well, this class proves that the things that you are learning, you are going to use in real life. In this class, we're doing basically career-based stuff. So when we do go out into the career field, we're ready for what is going to happen. And it's just something that's going to prepare us more, especially with the learning techniques that our teacher has been using. It's more creative in a way, and it's easier to remember. One of the big things the students are getting out of this is an understanding of how CAD works, as well as how to work with the team, how to follow parameters through the different handbooks, rules, and regulations that CODA has set for their, their competition. And so there's all different types of, of fun little tricks and attributes that they're learning and they don't really realize it while trying to win this contest to go see a Formula One race. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, six. No, so that is the solar